Shalom. Shalom. This lesson is about has Yahweh cast away his people. We know Yahweh changed not, right? Right. So we won't be consumed. Right. For Jacob won't be consumed. So he ain't going to change for nobody, right? Right. Let me get that in Malachi chapter 3, verse 6. Malachi 3 and 6. For I am the Lord. I change not. You see that? Right. right. So the Most High, yeah, he changed not, right? Right. So, we, so why people think he changed? What he gonna change for humans for? Right. When he created us, right. he created this world. What he gonna change for? Right. So when he put in order, that's what stands, right? Right. Go ahead. Therefore, ye sons of Jacob are not consumed. So Jacob won't be destroyed, right? Right. Let me get Genesis uh, thirty-five and twelve. Jacob is Israel, right? Right. Jacob is the progenitor of the twelve tribes of Israel. Right. That's our forefather, right? Right. And he changed not, so we won't be destroyed. Right, right. Right. Go ahead. Genesis 35 and 12. And the land which I gave Abraham and Isaac to thee, I will give it. So he said he'll give it all to us. Right, hmm? right. He'll give it all to the 12 tribes of Israel. That's us, man. Right. So he ain't going to change and cast us away mm -hmm. like we nothing. Right? right. Go ahead. And to thy seed after thee will I give the land. You see that? What that say? And Read it again. And to thy seed after thee. And to thy seed after thee. Right, right. So after our forefathers, we will retain everything in the earth, right? Right. Go ahead. Will I give the land? 13? Yeah, yeah go to 13. And God went up from him in the place where he talked with him. Right. Go to uh, jump to Genesis chapter 32, verse 28. So the most high, he ain't going to change for nobody. Right. You know what I'm saying? He promised us the land. He promised us everything, right? Right. You know what I'm saying? So he's not going to cast us away like we're nothing, right? Right. right. Go ahead. Genesis 32, 28. And he said, thy name shall be called no more Jacob. But Israel, for as a prince has thou power with God. We're the prince of the power, right? That's who we are. Right. We're the prince of the power. Right. Go ahead. And with men and has prevailed. We're going to have power over all men. See, he gave men mm -hmm. on the earth blessings, right? Right. But we retain the power to control all men, right? Right, right. And we're supposed to put men in what? Subjection. To follow who? The, the most, most high. high power. Yeah. Go ahead. That's it on that? Mm -hmm. Go to uh, Genesis 49 and 28. All right. So this lesson is talking about Yahweh have not cast away his people. Go right. ahead. Genesis 49 and 28. All these are the 12 tribes of Israel. Right. We are the 12 tribes of Israel. Mm -hmm. hmm? And this is it, that their father spake unto them and blessed them. Everyone, according to his blessing, he blessed them. Yeah, he blessed us all hmm? right, right. with the earth, with right. everything, the whole possession, the covenant and the law. That's right. our blessings, right? Right. Let me get, that's it on that? Mm -hmm. That's what it, mm -hmm. Let me get Numbers 23, 19. And we know that the most high he do what? He lie not. Why he gonna lie? Mm -hmm. Why would he lie to us, right? Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? His word stands forever. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? He don't have no reason to lie because he created everything. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And we know that his word what? Stands forever. We still are going to the, script, the uh, scriptures right now today, right? Mm -hmm. right. And see prophecy, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Numbers 23 and 19. God is not a man that he should lie, neither the son of man that he should repent. Right. Have he said and shall he not do it? Or have he spoken and shall he not make it good? Right, right, right. And that's uh, Numbers 23 and 19. Mm-hmm. He said, even, read that again? He said, even the son? Mm -hmm. wow. God is not a man that he should lie, neither the son of man that he should repent. Have he said and shall not do it? Or have he spoken and shall he not make it good? Yeah, so have he spoken? You know what I'm saying? He spoke and he said what? That he going to give us everything. 
Right. He right. spoke and said what? That he chose us. Right. You know what I'm saying? He's not going to lie. No. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? So mm -hmm. if, he, if he said he chose us, right? right? And we his chosen, you know what I'm saying? That means that his word stands. Right, right. So he have not cast us away. Mm -hmm. The most high haven't cast Israel away, right? Mm -hmm. right. Let me get, uh, what's that? Isaiah 40 and 8. Yeah, so we got to, like, get off of that. These Christians, they need to get off of that, thinking that the most high cast away his people, that he's not dealing with us no more. You know? <laughs> he haven't cast our, his people away because there's only, what, 12 gates. Right. right. Only the 12 tribes of Israel get through the gates. Right. Ain't got no Gentile gate. No. Ain't got no heathen gates. Mm -hmm. Ain't got no Esau gates. It only, it's only 12 gates, man. Right. If you ain't part of the 12 tribes, you ain't getting in the kingdom. Right. You will be outside the kingdom right. as a servant right. building up our land. He didn't cast us away. He never dealt so with the other nations. Right. Go ahead. Isaiah 40 and 8. The grass withereth, the flower fadeth. But the word of Yahweh shall stand forever. You see that? <laughs> the word of what? Read that. The but, word of Yahweh stands forever. forever. Right. 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 But, Let me get Psalms 33, 11, and 12. So the word of Yahweh stands forever. He changed not. Right. You know? Right. He ain't cast us away. Mm -mm. Let me get Psalms 33, 11, Psalms 33, 11. The counsel of the Lord standeth forever. You hear that? Read that again. The counsel of the Lord standeth forever. The counsel of the Lord stands forever. What he say stands forever. He don't change. Right, right. The thoughts of his heart to all generations. Right. Blessed is the nation whose God is the Lord. Blessed is the who? The nation. The nation. Who God is the what? The Lord. Oh. What nation is that? Us. Us, Israel. Right. You know what I'm saying? We bless right. because he's our Lord, our God. He's not dealing with these other nations. Mm -hmm. He only dealing with us. Right. And he ain't cast us away. Mm -hmm. You got to be crazy. And the people whom he have chosen. Who he choose? <clears throat> Israel. He chose us. Right. For his own inheritance. Right. For his own inheritance. The Most High have not cast away his people. He chose Israel for his own inheritance. He didn't have not dealt so with any other other nations. Mm -hmm. He's not dealing with them, you know. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? So it's not of Yah to be bringing these other nations inside of your sanctuary. Right. right. You know what I'm saying? Dealing with these other nations, mm -hmm. keeping Sabbath with these other nations, keeping any of the ho high holy days with these other nations. We should not be doing that because He haven't dealt so with these people. Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? These people will be servants. Right. They can't come into your con congregation right. now or never, you know? Right. Let me get uh, uh, Ecclesiastes chapter 1. Start at 9. Right. Most high ain't deal with these people and we want to be amongst these people. If you're going to be amongst these people, you know what I'm saying, just deal with them according to the world. Don't deal with them according to the scriptures right. because this is not a worldly book. This book is only for the Israelites. It was written by us and written for us. Right. This is our heritage, our history, our customs is in here. Not for the world, man. Right. You know what I'm saying? That's why this world is doing what today? It's crumbling. It's right. falling apart. Right. This world is nothing. Right. This kingdom is, is coming to an end. Right. Ecclesiastes 1 and 9. The thing that hath been, it is that which shall be. Yeah, so the thing, it's, it's nothing new in the sun, man. Right. What happened before time is going to happen now. Right. It's nothing new. Everything constantly repeating itself, man. And that which is done is that which shall be done. Right. So every so the scripture that we reading and we see what happened to the Israels, the Israelites, mm -hmm. and we know like if the Israelites keep the laws of the Most High, that's when the law, the Most High go be as a mist in their presence, right? Right, right? If they keep the laws, if they don't keep the laws, what happened? The Most High turn his back on them. Mm -hmm. But he never casts us away. He called us to come back to the fold. He called us to come back and keep his laws. He never, he never walk away for us and uh, uh, turn his back on us, right? He never cast us away, man. Go ahead. And there is no new thing under the sun. Is there anything whereof it may be said? See, this is new. It had been already of old time, which was before us. Right, right. So nothing never changed. Right. That's it on that? 11. 
There is no remembrance of former things. Neither shall there be any remembrance of things that are to come with those that shall come after. Right, right, right. So there's no remembrance of our past. Right. There's no remembrance of the things that we did in our past. And there's no remembrance of things to come. Right. right? right. You know what I'm saying? So we got to go by what's in these scriptures. Right. You know what I'm saying? This is our remembrance right here. So now we know that the Most High, he changed not, and he have not cast away his people, so he's not going to cast us away, right? Because he chose us. He chose Israel, right? Let me get Deuteronomy 76. Deuteronomy 7, verse 6. For thou art a holy people unto the Lord thy God, the Lord thy God have chosen thee to be a special people unto himself. We are special people. We are holy people unto the Most High. So how he going to cast away a special people, a holy people unto himself? How he going to cast us away? It's, it don't make no sense. Above all people that are upon the face of the earth. Above who? All people that are upon the face of the earth. So that tells you right there that the Most High chose us. And he ain't dealing with the other people. He said we above all other people mm -hmm. on the face of the earth. And that's mm -hmm. how we got to start acting. That's right. Let me get uh, uh, Isaiah 43 and 10. Isaiah 40 3. Yeah, and 10. The voice of him that crieth in the wilderness. Isaiah 43. Oh, 43. I thought it was 43. Sorry. 43 and 10. Right. Uh, Isaiah 43 and 10. Ye are my witnesses, said the Lord, and my servant who I have chosen. He chose us to be his servant, to be his witness. Go ahead. That ye may know and believe me and understand that I am he. Before me, there was no God form. There's no God form before him. So these people praying to this Jesus character, these people praying to Buddha, these people praying to all these idols, it's fake. It's not real, man. Go ahead. Neither shall there be after me. And ain't going to be no gods after him, man. It's only one true power. And that's yeah. Ain't no other power here. On earth, you know what I'm saying? That's greater than him. Ain't no other power. It's only one true power, and that's Yah. Mm -hmm. Let me get, uh, where we at? That was that's Isaiah it. 43 and 10. Let me get Isaiah 44, 1 and 2. Isaiah 44, 1. Yet now hear, O Jacob, my servant, in Israel, whom I have chosen. You see that? He chose us. Thus said the Lord, that made thee and formed thee from the womb, which will help thee. Fear not, O Jacob, my servant, and thou, Jeshurun, who I have chosen. Mm -hmm. That's it on that, that's too. Mm -hmm. Right. Go to uh, Deuteronomy 28, 15. Yahweh only turned his face on us. That's it. He just turned his face on us because of our sin. Because we was deep in sin. Because we didn't want to keep his commandments. So now we got to come back and keep his commandments, right? So he could be in the midst of us. Go ahead. Deuteronomy 28 and 15. But it shall come to pass if thou will not hearken unto the voice of the Lord thy God. And what's the voice of the Lord thy God? His commandments. Go ahead. To observe, to do all his commandments and his statutes, which I command thee this day, that all these curses shall come upon thee. So if we don't keep his commandments... Curse is going to come upon us. And overtake me. And overtake us, man. Right. So that's what's going on with our community today. Right. Because we deep in sin. Right. So we falling under the curses. Right. So all we got to do is come back into the truth. Right. And keep the laws. That's all we got to do. Yeah. Let me get uh, Deuteronomy 31, 17. You can go on like that if you want to. Deuteronomy 31 and 17. Then my anger shall be kindled against them in that day, and I will forsake them, and I will hide my face from them. You see that? He hid his face from us, right? right, right. Because we was in sin. Right. You and, don't have to keep saying right, please. Go ahead. And I will hide my face from them, 
and they shall be devoured and many evils and troubles shall befall them. So, so that you see that we being devoured, right? We being devoured because we in sin. We, we being destroyed because of the sin, right? That we've been committing, you know? So we got to come back into this truth. We got to start back keeping the laws. It's showing you right here. Start again. 17. Then then my anger shall be kindled against them in that day. You see that? His anger is kindled against us because of our sin. Go ahead. And I will forsake them, and I will hide my face from them. He's forsake us, and he's hiding his face from us. Go ahead. And they shall be devoured. And we will be devoured. We being devoured right now. That's why we at the bottom, right? Go ahead. And many evils and troubles shall befall them. What's going on right now? Evils and troubles is falling upon us. Why? Because we broke his commandments. Go ahead. So that they will say in that day, are not these evils come upon us because our God is not among us? Yeah, you see that? Ain't none but evilness came upon us because he's not among us. He turned his face on us. So we're going through nothing but trials and tribulations, right? right. That's it on that? That's 17. Go to 18. And I will surely hide my face in that day for all the evils which they shall have which they shall have wrought in that they are turned unto other gods. Right, right, right. You see that we turn to other gods. Look at our people. They follow this fool named Jesus. They follow him, uh, Buddha. They follow him, Krishna. What's that other god, that Buddha god or whatever? Some old crazy Indian god or something. They follow all of these idol gods that's nothing, right? So the Most High, he turned his face on us. Yeah. And he gave us over to our vile affections, right? You know what I'm saying? Nothing but dumbness, stupidness, right? You know what I'm saying? We lost. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Let me get uh, Micah, uh, chapter 3, verse 4. Yeah, we lost. You know what I'm saying? We don't know what's going on. We don't know what to do. You got Christian people talking about uh, 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 they love sin. <laughs> Nobody perfect. You can't be perfect. We all in sin. Well, that's why the Most High told us to repent. You know what I'm saying? You're supposed to repent for your sins. That's right. And then you're supposed to sin not. That's right? right? Go ahead. Uh, Micah 3 and 4. And 4. Then shall they cry unto the Lord, but he will not hear them. You hear that? So we crying upon the Lord. We praying. You know what I'm saying? That's why I always say all that praying that people doing that stuff don't work. How you go pray and sin? You know what I'm saying? The most high don't hear the prayers of sinners. So all that praying you doing, you praying all day, that stuff don't work because you're in sin. You got to change your ways. You got to stop sinning. You know what I'm saying? And you got to keep the commandments. That's the first thing you got to do. You got to repent. You got to keep the commandments. Then the most high might hear your sin, your uh, prayers. He's not ever listening to you anyway. He's sending angels down here. He's sending angels down here to watch you, man. The most high is not dealing with us. Who the, uh, uh, Yahawashah, he's not dealing with us. You know what I'm saying? It's angels. It's lords that's come down here and is dealing with us. That's doing the most high charge. And if you is unclean, you're wearing all these uh, uh, idols on your clothes. You're wearing Nike signs on your hat, idols on your clothes. The most high is not hearing your prayers because you got an idol on you. You know what I'm saying? You got idols in your house. The most high is not coming into your temple because you got idols in your temple. You know what I'm saying? We got to take this word serious. We got to stop playing around. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? We keep playing around. We're going to find ourselves like Christians. You know what I'm saying? We're going to become it. We will become farther and farther from the true power. You know what I'm saying? If you, you got to take this truth serious. You know what I'm saying? People say, oh, you're over-righteous. It, it, it's no way to be over-righteous keeping the most high laws. You know what I'm saying? They just uh, fail to uh, understand that scripture. You know what I'm saying? Because they are uh, Christians. They are uh, uh, church people, really. Oh, you, uh, you don't want to wear Nikes? Nah, I ain't wearing no Nikes, man. Those, those church people that want you to wear Nikes, those Christians, those no, not uh, real Israelites. You know what I'm saying? You're wearing Nikes and stuff, and you know that's an idol. That swoop sign's an idol. You're a Christian. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's, it's not time to be playing no more. You know what I'm saying? We got to take these word, this word up in this book serious. You know what I'm saying? We got to come out of her. We got to come out of this world and stop uh, keeping the things of this world. You know what I'm saying? We just got to work with the people, these heathens and stuff like that's in the world. We work with them on the outside. You know what I'm saying? So we can take care of our families. But other than that, in the spiritual aspect, we don't deal with these people. We don't keep none of their high holiday. I mean, they holidays and none of that. You know what I'm saying? We got to let these people go. Mm -hmm. So the most high can look back upon us. You know what I'm saying? Because it looks like he casts us away. But the reason why I look like that, because we ain't serious. You see all these other Buddha people. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? They be serious. Mm -hmm. 
They be serious, but the, uh, but we don't want to be serious. We want to be half step. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You see all these uh uh uh, uh what you call them other people that be uh wearing turbans and stuff like Muslim. that. Muslims. You see the I think they Muslims. The uh, them uh Ottoman Turk people. I think they Muslims. You see the Muslims. They be all draped up, wearing uh, uh they garments and stuff like that. You don't see them wearing no freaking uh uh uh. uh Signs like uh, 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 Nike signs and stuff like that. Yeah. You feel me? They be wearing garments and, and stuff. And they don't even send their kids to school during like Ramadan and stuff like that. Right. You know, I'm a teacher, and they would literally miss a whole week of school. You feel like where uh, you know five of these kids, Muslim kids, at? But they're oh, they're keeping their Ram their holiday. Right, right, right. That's right. how serious, like you said, they take it. Right. So it's okay for us to be a part of this world and to be in the truth too. Uh -uh. You know what I'm saying? It's okay for us to wear all that uh, uh, abomination. And to be in the truth, I don't see how it is. I, that's Christianity to me. Mm -hmm. I don't believe it. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So I will not be doing it, man. Mm -hmm. That's how you retain your blessings. You got to keep your domain. You got to keep your sanctuary clean. You got to get all, you got to purge all the uh, 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 idols out of your uh, sanctuary if you want the most high to look upon you. Mm -hmm. if, he, you if you want the most high to send his angels to you. You know what I'm saying? Because he ain't dealing with us. He's too powerful to deal with us. You know what I'm saying? Just like what Jacob said. Jacob said he's seen the ladder and he's seen the angels coming uh, uh, to and fro. You know what I'm saying? The the angel, uh, 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 Job, when he said that uh, uh, he was talking to, uh, the angel was talking to Satan. And Satan was like, uh, 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 say, uh, the angel said, where are you going? He said, I'm going to and fro to the earth. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? To and fro amongst the earth. You know what I'm saying? Then the uh, angel told Satan to do this uh, craft. I want you to go and tempt Job. I want you to go and do this. What you think was going on with us? We getting That's tempted. Right. Wasn't Job in the truth? Mm -hmm. So Job was in the truth, and he was one one of the most uh, a devout man of the Most High, right? Kept his laws, and he still got tempted. That's right. You know what I'm saying? So we don't think we go, we getting tempted. You know what I'm saying? To follow these worldly customs. You feel me? That's why he said, "Come out of her." You know what I'm saying? It's time to come out of her and take this truth serious. Because if not, you know what I'm saying? We gonna be in that pit. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? With the demons, man. You know what I'm saying? He don't, he's not a respected person. He don't care about what you doing. He don't care if you got one foot in, one foot out. He ain't he ain't dealing with you. You know what I'm saying? When you when uh, when that flesh die and that spirit go to the chambers and you become and you get it's time for you to get judged, you know what I'm saying? He's not a respected person, he'll destroy you. Go ahead. <clears throat> he will even hide his face from them at that time. Hmm. As they have behaved themselves ill in their doing. Right, he go. He come on, man. We gotta take this. We gotta take this serious. What he say? Because we have be. Uh, 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 As they have behaved themselves ill in their doing. That means we just uh, doing nothing but wickedness, doing what we want to do. Oh man, he, he, you being over righteous, man. You could do that. Okay, I'm gonna be over righteous, man. And you can follow Satan. You know what I'm saying? Because Satan run everything on this earth. Because the earth was given to the hand of the wicked, man. Everything on this earth is of Satan. You wearing homosexual clothes and all type of stuff, man. You know what I'm saying? You better try to uh, 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 pray over your clothes or get you some cotton shirts or something like I wear. I wear the same thing, man. I came out of that worldly stuff, man. I wear the same thing. Cotton clothes, cotton uh, sweats. You know what I'm saying? I pray over my clothes, everything, man. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm trying to get the most high to look back upon me. I'm trying to be clean. You know what I'm saying? I'm trying to get a, a, a shield of protection upon me for when I go out into this satanic world, I'll be uh, uh, saved. You know what I'm saying? I'll be uh, 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 guarded by the angels. You feel me? I'll be safe, man. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's what that's that's why I try to uh, follow the laws to the best of my ability so I won't be cast away. You feel me? That's what this lesson is about. Has Yah cast away his people? Well, it seems like he casts us away, casts us away. And the reason why it seems like that, because we don't keep his commandments. You feel me? We don't want, we want to do what we want to do. Yeah. We don't want to keep his commandments. We in the truth, we still don't want to keep his commandments. We think that people, you know what I'm saying? Uh, 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 if you're an Israelite, uh, even if you a wicked Israelite, I, uh, uh, when you die, you still get to, you still get to the kingdom. I didn't heard that nonsense, man. People just said, even if you Israel, if you're an Israelite and you die as an Israelite, you still get to the kingdom. But if you read, uh, uh, what's that? First Corinthians six and nine. Go uh, get that. If people they they be doing what they want to do. That's that. That's that uh, good uh, Christianity. That's that pastor stuff. You know what I'm saying? You try to get people in. I want to get brothers in, so brother, you can be wicked. Cause that's that's that comp, that's that come as you are. Mm -hmm. 
That's not coming. That's your doctrine. That's the doctrine of Satan. Oh, if you're a wicked Israelite, man, but still, though, you're an Israelite. So when you get, when you die, I, when you die, I, you still get in the kingdom. So you mean to tell me I could do all this foolishness and not? That's what my pastor told me, bro. So why I'm in the truth then? You feel me? Yeah. My pastor told me all you got to do is pray and say these three words. Uh, uh son. All you got to do, son, is pray and say these three words. Something like that, right? Uh, I, believe. I believe. Yeah, you, you know what I'm saying? That's the same thing these fools said. We didn't tell you, oh, you could be wicked, but you still, when you die, you'll get in the kingdom. Read that right there. Know ye not that the unrighteous shall not inherit the kingdom of God? Be not deceived. Neither fornicators, nor idolaters, nor adulterers, nor effeminate. So what is righteousness? The only way you can be righteous is if you keep the laws. So it said, no, you not that that unrighteous is not going to receive the kingdom. Mm -hmm. the, so righteousness is keeping the laws. Who did he give the laws to? He didn't give the laws to the whole world. He only gave the laws to Israel. Mm -hmm. So it's 147, 19, and 20. So, you know what I'm saying? So he told to Israel right here. So if you're not keeping his laws and you're an Israelite, you're going to the pit. Mm -hmm. You're not going to get into the kingdom. He don't care who you is. He makes some more people if you want to. Mm -hmm. He the creator, man. What the heck, he, yo, sinful, oh, uh, I'm an Israelite, so I, I, I can still sin. Well, he don't, come on, man. He only want the, this place is a test, man. This place is full of wickedness. He only want the uh, the righteous in his kingdom, man. He ain't dealing with nobody else. You know what I'm saying? He only want the righteous Israelites in his kingdom that's keeping his laws, that's fighting to keep his laws to the best of their ability, the ones that they know, the ones that can do, because all the laws do not, uh, 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 refer to us anyway. It's like one of the laws, if you got a garden, right? Most of Israel don't even know how to grow, grow no plants anyway. So that law don't apply to you. Mm -hmm. So if you got a garden, when you're growing your crops and stuff, you're supposed to give a, a portion of your garden, a, a portion of your food away. That law don't apply to you. So a lot of the laws don't apply to us. So you got to go by the laws that apply to us, man. You know what I'm saying? Just like if you have a beard. You feel me? The laws was for the sinful, right? So if you already got a beard, the uh, uh, the law, uh, uh, what's that, uh, Leviticus uh, uh, 21 to 5, the uh, the law of a beard, you're supposed to have a beard, don't apply to you if you already got a beard. You feel me? So, man, that's out the way, right? So we got to come back to these laws and keep these laws so we won't be under the law no more. You know what I'm saying? If you keep the laws, how you going to be under the law? You, you keeping them. You ain't under them no more. It's for the wicked who's breaking the laws, right? Go ahead and sit on that. Mm -hmm. Let's sit on that. I'm going to go to Ezekiel uh, 39, 23. Yeah, so we got to come back and keep these laws before he can look upon us. Man, you know what I'm saying? We can't let these wicked people, this wicked nation keep winning. And, and look at us. Uh, you got all these fools keeping 4th of July. Come on, how, why, how? I don't even understand it. Like, make it make sense. How black, why is black people keeping 4th of July in these holidays? You free now. You wasn't keeping these uh, uh, high holy days before slavery when you was in Africa? Huh? You wasn't keeping these uh, 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 slave uh, holidays? Why are you doing it now? You're free. He then took the chains. The white man took the chains off you. Now you got your mind. You get pissed off. You ain't keeping uh, 4th of July. Hell no, I ain't keeping no 4th of July. They get pissed off at you. You ain't coming to my barbecue and keeping 4th of July. I don't keep that slave tradition, man. I'm free. Man, I'm being free. When I touched down on this earth, I was free, man. I'm a free man. I don't have to keep none of these slave traditions. I would to keep the traditions of the Most High that's in the script. Mm -hmm. I'm not a slave no more like y'all fools, man. The fools are slaves. That's why it seemed like he cast us away. Because y'all fools, your God is uh, Esau. Your God is Christmas, Easter, Thanksgiving, a birthday. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That's your God. A dumb idols. Dumb idols is your God. You know what I'm saying? We worship in dumb idols. You don't ever want to worship. You worship the dumb idols and don't want to keep the Sabbath. You, they run. Oh, it's, it's, it's Easter. We got to go and get the uh, the chicken and the uh, the ribs. The pork ribs. When he said you ain't supposed to even eat pork. Oh, nah, I, that's cast away. That's what the fools tell you. They run to fall asleep, but don't want That's that's Yeah, he cast them fools away. Because they run to fall asleep, but don't want to uh, fall the most high. Don't want to do nothing. Yeah, he cast those fools away. Fools away because they don't want to keep the laws. It's crazy, man. Go ahead. Ezekiel 39 and 23. And the heathen shall know that the house of Israel went into captivity for their iniquity. You hear that? Who went into captivity? 
Yeah, we for our inequity, right? For our sin. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. Because they trespassed against me. We Therefore, trespassed, we sinned against the most high, man. Therefore, hide I my face from them and gave them into the land, excuse me, the hand of their enemies. Man, who went to slavery, man? On ships, huh? It's talking about this is talking about us. We the Israelites, man. So, Ain't no other nation went through what we went through. You know what I'm saying? Other nations went through slavery or what they want to call uh, uh, servants or something like that with their own people. Indigenous servants. Indigenous servants so with their own people. You know what I'm saying? The Irish went to, uh, 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 became an indigenous servant with the Irish and the British. That's the same people, man. Same Caucasians from the Caucasus. <laughs> they want to try, oh, we different. Y'all look exactly alike. How y'all different? Ain't that's bull crap. I think that's the same people, man. They all from the Caucasus Mountains, man. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So, they no nation on earth went through what we went through because the other nations from far who spoke a language that we didn't understand is the ones that put us in captivity. What other nation done that? Ain't none. Go ahead. Mm -hmm. So, sorry. So, fell they all by the sword. Yes, yeah, so we fell by the sword, though, didn't we? Come on, this is talking about us. This is prophecy right here. Mm -hmm. This is prophecy. It's talking mm -hmm. about us, man. Right? That's why we read it's nothing new in the sun. That's right. What happened before time will happen, happen now. That's right. So all the stuff that you read about the Israelites that happened to them before time is happening to us now. We yes. just don't have a remembrance of it. Mm -hmm. We probably living it right now. This probably, huh? This yeah. probably, we probably wrote this today. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be written right after us. Mm -hmm. This is us. Mm -hmm. This is exactly talking about us. Yeah. Right? Ain't nothing new in the sun. We just don't remember. That's right. Let me get uh, uh, Isaiah uh, start at one. So all we got to do is come back and keep his laws. That's all we got to do. Mm -hmm. Start at four. Okay. Chapter one. Yeah, chapter one. Isaiah four. one and four. A uh, sinful nation, a people laden with inequity. That's us, sinful nation. That's why I said there's nothing new in the sun. We sinful nation. A seed of evildoers. Well, see, evildoers, man. Children that are corruptors. Children as well. You see the children, huh? They, they, these people today think your daughter must be a boy. Your son must be a girl. Come on, that is crazy. They, and then it, the children is, is a lunatics they damn self. And why none of the boys walk uh, right? You know what I'm saying? All their legs is like this and they walk heck of weird, man. You know what I'm saying? Why is everybody weird now? You know, that's It gotta be. You, we used to have people they used to call uh, uh, jocks or something like that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. people play football yeah. tough. This new generation of kids, man, I don't even know. Man. Mm -mm. I don't even know what's going on. That you, don't, you go outside, you don't see nobody. No kid outside. Mm -mm. You know what I'm saying? We used to be back in the day playing football, catching all that stuff. These little kids now today that's growing up, I don't know what's going on with them. They some weird kids, man. You know what I'm saying? They can barely walk straight. Can't catch. The, uh, always giving up on everything. Man, these people... And their parents is raising these kids to be weak, man. Yeah. They raised them like heathens. The heathens was the ones that was so weak. Mm -hmm. That couldn't walk. That couldn't catch. Couldn't do nothing. You know what I'm saying? Now look at our kids. Raising like the heathens. Can't ride no bike. Man. You know what I'm saying? But we... we the, uh, uh, we need to be uh, uh, oppressed. You know what I'm saying? We got to be oppressed so we can tell our kids to get your ass outside so our kids won't have all these fucking uh, 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 toys and computers and stuff and sit in the house all day and as far as they walk us to the refrigerator to get something to eat and be overweight at the age of six. You know what I'm saying? This is crazy, man. You know what I'm saying? We, Israel got to be oppressed to the most high come back because if you ain't oppressed, man, you will be destroyed. You destroy it, man. It's crazy. Let me see. Children that are corruptors. The children that are corruptors. Children that's fools, man. They have forsaken the Lord. Look, look, all, all these, you see the side shows and all that stuff going on. Forsaken the Lord. They went crazy. On side show at, back in the day was all right. You know what I'm saying? Because we used to ride around and we used to show off our cars and stuff like that. Now these fools shooting and doing all type of wickedness. Crazy. Running people over now. You see that shit? I this this shit crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. They running people over and on top of stuff. You see people trying to run, jump in the car, bang and smack, flip, get up, run like man. These children is what what is it corrupted? Corrupted. Yeah, these these some fools. They man. have forsaken the Lord. They forsaken the Lord, man. They, they have crazy. provoked the Holy One of Israel into anger. Man, they did. And we did provoke him to anger. He pissed off. That's why the world is falling apart. They are gone away backwards. <laughs> they back. 
backwards, man. Exactly. They crazy. Yeah. It's off the hood. This is a prophecy. Look what's going on right now. So got all these stupid fools running around with these super skin tight jeans. With the nails painted, mm -hmm. you know it's well, crazy. Up and wearing the hoochie shorts, you know hoochie shorts and stuff, man. This is crazy, man. It's like, man, I wish I could just live in the forest in the house, man. I want to live amongst these fools because ain't nothing going on. They ain't doing nothing. They ain't doing nothing. It ain't crazy, man. That's why I see like the most high cast uh, cast us away. Look, you see how we act. You be like, yeah, those. I guess you. They be like, I guess. But his, he doesn't be like, I guess those was the most hard people because, shit, look at them. I don't know. Uh, if it's so, he had to cast them away because look at these fools. You got men acting like women. Uh, grown men got their nails painted. I ain't never seen. We used to be sagging our jeans. Wear, uh, we used to wear baggy uh, jabot jeans. You know what I'm saying? With uh, white tees. You know what I'm saying? Like, man, like, now they, now they wearing heels. They wearing heels. Yeah, yeah man, it's it's crazy, man. It's heck of crazy. Jump to nine. Uh, uh, yeah, we're at. Isaiah 1. Oh, yeah, jump to nine, 9 to 11. Except the Lord of hosts had left us, has left unto us a very small remnant. He only left a small remnant of us, huh? We should have been as Sodom. Man, we supposed to be destroyed. All of us supposed to be destroyed. We all was in wickedness, man. Man, it's a blessing that we was able to wake up and see how wicked that stuff is, man, and come out of her. We yeah. came up out of her. Yeah. We was like in the belly of Satan, man, and we came up out of that belly. Yeah. And now we out on the outside looking like, ooh, that shit is wicked. I don't want no parts of it. I'm chilling. And man. we should have been like unto Gomorrah. Yeah, yeah, we should have been destroyed, man. Hear the word of the Lord, ye rulers of Sodom. Give ear unto the law of our God, ye people of Gomorrah. Right. To what purpose is the multitude of your sacrifices unto me? Yeah, like, what purpose are all our sins? You know what I'm saying? What purpose are we trying to sin and sacrifice unto the Lord? He like, man, I ain't dealing with you. You, Tuesday, you sinning. Wednesday, you trying to sacrifice to the Lord. He like, nigga, like, I ain't listening. I ain't trying to hear you. I don't ever know who you are. Mm -mm. Go ahead. Said the Lord, I am full of your burnt offerings of ram and the fat of your fed beasts, and I delight not in the blood of bullocks or of lambs or of he goats. Yeah, so this right here is the law that's done away with. The law of sacrifice. This is telling you right here, he done with the law of sacrifice because we is embedded in sin, right? If it wasn't for your Havasha to bring us back into the old covenant, we'd be through. Yeah. Go ahead. Um, 12. Uh, jump to 15. <clears throat> 15. And when he spread forth, when ye spread forth your hands, I will hide my eyes from you. You see that? He turned his face on us when we spread our hands and try to pray. That's why I'm saying praying don't work. All that praying after these fools be doing, they pray so you get in trouble. You go to jail, son. You pray. I know a person that went to, that uh, uh, robbed somebody at a versatile. Rob somebody out of versatile, end up going to jail, forsake the Lord because he got convicted. Like, nigga, you was in sin. How you going to forsake the Lord, not believe in the Lord, because you uh, uh you robbed somebody in sin and you went to jail and now you don't want to deal with the uh, uh, the true power. You don't want to deal with the power. You was the one in sin. Mm -hmm. You feel me? You ain't supposed to sin. Yeah. So you would get punished for your sin, you fools. Yeah. These be people crazy, man. I will hide head. my eyes from you. Yeah, when ye make many prayers, I will not hear. You hear that? You see that? He go, if you ain't seeing, he ain't hearing your prayers. Your hands are full of blood. Your hand is full of blood, man. You wicked, man. What's that, 15 and 17? That was 15. Wash you. Make you clean. Put away the evil of your doings before my eyes. Cease to do evil. Right, he's telling the wash us, make us clean. He's telling us to cease to do evil. We got to stop doing evil and repent, man. Yeah. Learn to do well. Seek judgment. Relieve the oppressed. Judge the fatherless. Plead for the widow. Right, right. So we got to do right for the Most High to hear our prayers. For he could look back upon us. You know what I'm saying? This is only for Israel. So we got to change our ways, man. You know what I'm saying? Like what we did. We changed our ways. Yep. So the Most High can look upon us and give us another chance, man. That's right. Go to uh, Second uh, Chronicles. 
chapter 30, verse 9. Second Chronicles 30 and 9. For if ye turn again unto the Lord, your brethren and your children shall find compassion before them. So if we turn back to the Lord and keep his commandments, we will find compassion, right? That led them captive so that they shall come again into this land. For the Lord your God is gracious and merciful and will not turn away his face from you if you return unto him. Right, so we just got to return unto him, keep his laws. That's what it said right there, right? Let me get Jeremiah 30 and 3. That's all we got to do. Mm -hmm. We just got to turn back to him. We can't listen to these Christian churches and try to keep us in sin. That's the that's the school of Satan. Mm -hmm. Of course, Satan wants you to sin, come as you are, do as you will. That's the old, oh, the laws done away with. Come on, man. You know what I'm saying? They want to keep us in sin for the most high so they can rule the earth, the earth for longer. The reason why the earth is coming tonight is because what? We keeping the uh, uh, commandments. That's right. Go ahead. Jeremiah 30 and 3. For lo, the days come, said the Lord that I will bring again the captivity of my people Israel and Judah, said the Lord. Right. And I will cause them to return to the land that I gave their fathers, and they shall possess it. Yeah, so he will give our land back to us. He will give the earth back to us if we keep his commandments. Let me go, let me get uh, Jeremiah 33 and 7. Scoot over a little bit. Jeremiah 33 and 7. Right. And I will cause the captivity of Judah and the captivity of Israel to return and will build them as at the first. Right. So he will do what? Read that again. I will cause the captivity of Judah and the captivity of Israel to return and will build them as at the first. Right. Keep going. And I will cleanse them from all their inequity. You hear that? He will cleanse us, right? Whereby they have sinned against me. Mm -hmm. And I will pardon all their inequities whereby they have sinned. And I and whereby they have transgressed against me. Mm -hmm. Nine. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. Go to uh, Psalms 147, 19 and 20. So no, the most high haven't cast us mm -hmm. away. You see that? Yeah. So he will fire. bring everything back to us, right? Mm -hmm. He will put us back into our rightful place, right? Mm -hmm. Go. Psalms 147, 19 and 20. Yeah, so he will bring us back into our rightful place because he has not cast us away, baby. We just got to start keeping his laws. You know what I'm saying? We got to start keeping his Sabbath days. Yeah. We got to keep his high holy days. We got to come out of this wicked world and start following him. Go ahead. Psalms 147, 19. He showed his word unto Jacob, his statutes and his judgments unto Israel. He have not dealt so with any nation. He have, been, he have not dealt so with any other nation but us, man. That's it on that? Mm -mm. And right. as for his judgments, they have not known them. Praise ye the Lord. The other nations have not known his judgments. Mm -mm. You know what I'm saying? So he, he ain't cast us away and start dealing with these other nations. No, nah, you can look at the world. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Look at how evil and wicked the world is. He's just waiting for us to come back, right? Mm -hmm. Let me get Amos chapter 3. Start at 1 to 2. He just waiting for us to come back. Amos by Hosea. Okay. Amos, I'm sorry. Amos 3, 1 and 2? Yeah. Amos 3 and 1. Hear this word that the Lord has spoken against you, O children of Israel, against the whole family which I brought up from the land of Egypt, saying, You only have I known. You see that? Only us. He only known us, right? Of all the families of the earth. Of all the families of the earth. Only us he know. Th therefore, I will punish you for all your iniquities. We being punished. You feel me? For our iniquity, for our sin. We the ones being punished. Not these other nations. that You see them wicked as ever. Mm -hmm. Dressed up like demons and all right, type of stuff. Right. Got that sermon machine. It's just nothing but wickedness on the earth. We being punished because we breaking the laws. They can do whatever they want to do. They can live it up. That's what they're supposed to be doing. They're supposed to be worshiping them idols. And we're supposed to be just sitting back looking at these fools. And if we keep the laws, we bear to see their destruction. 
we be able to sit back with the shit of protection around us and be able to watch their destruction and the fall of their kingdom. All right, that's it on that? Yeah. Let me get Romans uh, chapter 5, verse 10. Romans 5 and 10. For if when we were enemies, we were reconciled to God by the death of his son, much more being reconciled, we shall be saved by his life. Right, right. Let me get uh, Romans 9 and 4. Romans 9 and 4. Who are Israelites who pertaineth the adoption and the glory. So that said, what well, we pertain the adoption and the glory, right? And the covenants. And the covenants. We were, everything is given to us. The and other nations only got blessings. But we got everything, man. We the kings of the world. Mm -hmm. And the giving of the law. The giving of the law, everything. The and other nations didn't get the law. So why is y'all trying to teach the other nations the law? That's right. It's not time for us to teach the other nations the law. We got to worry about our salvation. You know what I'm saying? For when our king come back, for when Yahweh come back, then we go put these other nations as what? As our servants. Right? Go ahead. And the service of Yahweh and the promises. Mm hmm Whose are the fathers in whom concerning the flesh Christ came, who is over all. God bless forever. Right. Amen. So our king is over all. And they're going to appoint us to be over all. You know? You know what I'm saying? So we got to come back into this truth because the Most High have not cast us away. Let me get Romans 11. 11 and 1. Oh, yeah. 1 to 2. All right. Romans 11 and 1. I say then, have God cast away his people? See, this, and this is in the New Testament, right? This yep. is the New Testament, right? Right. Right. Romans, what? What's you saying? 11, 11 one and, two. and 1. I say then, have God cast away his people? God forbid. For I also am an Israelite of the seed of Abraham of the tribe of Benjamin. God have not cast away his people, which he foreknew. Woe ye not that excuse me, woe ye not what the scripture said of Elias, how he maketh intercession to God against Israel, saying three. Go. No, no, no. Okay. So right there what it said, that's Paul saying what? He's that not the most high away. have not cast us away, man. Mm -hmm. Which he for new in the uh old testament in the new testament. Mm -hmm. So that right there show you that the most high have not cast us away. I don't know what these uh, Christians talking about the Israelites was cast away and this and that, but Paul saying that we have not been cast away. So the Most High have not cast away. All we got to do is just come back into this truth and keep his high holy days. Now, if you don't keep his high holy days, you don't keep his Sabbath, you don't keep the laws, then he ain't dealing with you. You're going to the pit. You're going to the pit, to the lake of fire. You know. So we got to come back. If you come back, when you start keeping his laws, the Most High will deal with you. You know what I'm saying? So we got to come back, Israel. We got to keep these laws, and we got to pray, and we got to be ye there for separate from these other nations and stop dealing with these other nations, man. You know what I'm saying? Now is that time. It's crunch time to really get ourselves right with the Most High. Right. Shalom.